Hi guys, welcome to today's workout. I'm Johnny Hammond, I'm the head coach here at the lifting club and we are in the yard here at the LC. So, POA for today, we are doing 10 rounds of HIT. HIT stands for High Intensity Interval Training. It's 40 seconds work and 20 seconds rest or the ratio of two to one. Like I said, this workout will take 10 minutes. So we're gonna get straight into the warm up today. Like I said, everything is pure body weight. We're gonna start with some dynamic stretches and build it out from there. So first of all, you're gonna take your feet a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. We go to a Kozak squat. You're gonna alternate from left to right. Make sure you're tracking those hips back and you're pushing through the heel. Let's stay here for another five, four, three, two, one. Backwards lunges next, alternating on the toe. If you want to increase the stretch, take the hands over the top. Stay here for another five, four, three, two, one. Go down to all four position. Elbow to elbow. Open up, look towards the sky. We're going to repeat for five, four, three, two, one. Other side, exactly the same. These are called quadrupted rotation. Three, two, one. Take one knee out in front, hip floss forward and back. So we're loosening off your hip flexor here. If you want to increase the stretch, again, push those arms through for three, two, one. Left hand to left knee, push it out slightly. Hand goes on the floor. I'm just going to walk that knee in and out. For five, four, three, two, one. Go to the other leg. Back to those hip flosses. I'm pushing forward and back. Like I said, if you want to increase that stretch, arms go over the top. For three, two, one. Right hand into right knee, left hand on the floor. Walk it out for five, four, three, two, one. Back to your feet, let's start some air squats. Feet nice and wide, pushing through. You're gonna go here for 10, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Heel flicks on the toes now. Get that heart rate up. Stay here for another five, four, three, two, one. Crab walks, two to the left, staying nice and low, two to the right, yeah? Staying in that squat position. Two more rounds, one, two, nice and easy, high knees. Five, four, three, two, one, keep the knees going, put punches left and right in, jab cross. Five, four, three, two, one. Last one, jumping jacks or star jumps, nice and easy. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well then guys, have a little rest there. I'll give you exactly 30 seconds to have a breather, grab a quick drink. In the meantime, we're gonna get the timer ready Again, we're working around 10 rounds a day. 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. <clears throat> Have a quick drink. 20 seconds till we start. You'll hear the timer kick in from three. Your first movement today is that sumo squat or air squat position. I'm gonna take the feet out nice and wide. I'm gonna squat to 90 or just below and come back up to the top. Remember with HIT, it's about high intensity. So I'm trying to do as many reps as I can with inside that 40 second time. Okay, starting in 10, here we go. Sumo position, point those toes out. Starting in five, four, hands over the chest. Three, two, one, let's go. Bouncing through. I'm going for speed. Now, if you're struggling to get depth from the squat, you might want to take the feet a little bit wider. If you're feeling any pain, you can only do half squats. That's fine, yeah? Staying here for another 25. Try and get some blood in those quads. Pre-exhaust those legs. Another 20 seconds, and we're gonna to go to an upper body movement. Today we're gonna to work from upper to lower, yeah? Just over 10 seconds left, and you've got 20 to recover, stay with me. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, well done. 20 seconds rest, going into walkouts. We're targeting mainly push muscles, chest, triceps, shoulders. Feet are nice and wide. I'm gonna walk out, put one press up at the bottom, elbows nice and tight, push back up. All right, starting in three, two, one, let's go. Try and stay on my pace. One, 
Just breathe at the top. Two. It's your first 10 seconds gone. Now feel free to put two at the bottom. One, two. Or you can take the press ups out, you choose. 20 seconds. Just over 10 on the clock, stay with me. Here we go, count you in. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Two rounds down out of 10. Next one, going back to lower body. Two variations, backwards lunge. We did this in the warm up. Hands on the hips. Take one leg back, alternate. Want to make it a little bit harder? Jump, split, lunge. I'm going to start with the jumps. Here we go, three, two, one, we're in. Nice and high, stay on the toes. If you started with the jumps and you're starting to get out of breath, you can always go to the static one. 30 to go. Twenty seconds. If you want to join me on the static, that's fine. Fifteen seconds. Ten to go. I can't you in from five. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Pike push or push press. So we're going to that pike position. Two variations. Number one, go to the knees. I'm trying to pull my head under, pushing through the shoulders. Other the variation onto the tiptoes. Stick my bum in the air, head goes under my shoulders. Push through. Three, two, one, let's go. Really try and push your head under your shoulders. The next progression of this would be a handstand push up. Keep going, you've got 25 seconds on the clock. This is a burner. Shoulders will be on fire. If you need to drop to the knees, no problem. 15 seconds to go. Ten seconds. I'll count you from five. Here we go. Um, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. That's four rounds down. Let's try to get the heart rate up a little bit now. So opposite hand to opposite heel. Variation one. Stand and tap. Variation two. Bit of a jug to it. Yeah. I'm gonna stand and tap. Here we go. Starting in five, four, three, two, one. I want to tap that foot as many times as I can. Like I said, if you want to progress it, get a little jog on the go. Make sure I'm breathing out with every tap. Just over 25 seconds on the clock. This is our halfway point, we're doing well. 10 rounds, five down. 20 seconds to go, keep pushing. Well done, well done. Going back to some shoulder conditioning next. Staying with that cardiovascular theme. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice, relax, 20 second breather, grab a quick drink. Okay, we're doing jab and cross, yeah? We're putting those knees in. So keeping the shoulders and arms high, condition the deltoids. So in just over 10 seconds, here's your example. Second variation, just the arms. So in three, two, one, let's go. Trying to turn those knuckles over every time I throw a punch, yeah? You see I'm on my tiptoes. That's allowing me to punch a little bit faster. If I'm not, slightly slower, yeah? Just over 20 on the clock, stay with me. Round six out of 10. Back to lower body next. 15 seconds. As many punches as you can. Here we go, I count you in from five. Five, four, three, two, and one, well done. Okay, we're going to skater jumps, two variations. You can either step and step, or you can put a bigger jump, take the leg behind. Okay, I'm gonna start with variation two, go back to one when I get tired. Here we go, five, four, three, two, one. So we're looking at the stabilizer muscles in your legs. 
You're taking that leg back, try and point your toe. You can always make the jump higher and further to make it harder. 25 seconds left. We've got 20. I'm going to show you the second variation. Again, doing very similar, just not taking the leg behind. 10 seconds. All about quad strength here, yeah? Five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Three rounds to go. Press ups, variation one on the knees. This time I'm taking the elbows as close as I can to my ribs. Nice and tight, yeah? Variation two on the toes, full reps. By bringing my elbows in, I'm working more of the triceps with the chest in pairs, yeah? Three, two, one. Let's go, time's done. Remember, as many reps as I can in 40 seconds. Triceps are a small muscle group. But fatigue quickly. If you need to drop to the knees, that's fine. Remember, I'm trying to breathe out on exertion. So as I press, that's when I'm breathing out, yeah? Feel that core nice and tight throughout. We're halfway. 20 seconds of round number eight. Chest is on fire. 10 seconds. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Last two rounds now. Finish lines in sight. Going back to that squat position, but you're going to put a jump in. Yeah, so it can be as high or as low as you want. Variation one, small. Variation two, put a big jump in. Yeah, starting in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Try and keep the same tempo that you started with for me, yeah? So we're not getting any faster, but we're not getting any slower. And after this, you've got one more movement of the day to finish. It's a tough one. 25 seconds. If you are progressing it, try and point the toes in the air, yeah? 15 seconds. Those legs are really fatiguing. Go back to that normal squat. Stay with me for 10. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, last round. That means burpees. Two variations. Number one, hands to the floor first. I'm gonna step my right leg, step my left, and bring them back. Variation two, chest to floor, snap my legs through, jump up. Three, Two, one, let's go, time's on. Whatever variation you're doing, maximum effort as fast as you can. Snap those hips through at the top, 30 seconds. This is your last bit of work for today. Stay with me. 20. Fifteen seconds. Last few reps. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. That was 10 rounds of hit smash. I hope you enjoyed that with myself, Johnny, head coach here at the lifting club. See you very soon. Have a great day.